I'm not gonna hold you. I'll probably say this is my favorite Tamin video we've done so far. Oh, for real? Um, I, I mean, why though? Why? Why was it your favorite? I honestly, man, I I think it was something that was small throughout the video that was done, and I enjoy it because it's like it was smart. Like when he said the criminal part, it's like. It seemed like he kept trying to do his choreography that he was locked up, but it's like for him to try to dance the whole way like this, like mm-hmm. I just felt like he did it throughout the whole video. It was like everything he did, he always wanted to make sure he was locked up as far as like a criminal. And I'm guessing this is a female, like he's saying like uh, how she has him like mm-hmm. locked up or whatever. But um, bro, just taming in, in general, bro, just yeah, as for far real. as his his energetic uh self and his his choreography bro just the passion he put behind just just all his videos but this video in particular that i watched bro it just i i don't know man it's just like he he went all out not, not necessarily went all out but just like the passion behind it bro mm-hmm. like and it's not to say he didn't have passion in his other videos but you know every video is different but this video just got it, it spoke to me more as far as passion wise and i really enjoyed that like just watching him do like the choreography and like i said and just the moves and like the intensity it seemed like every move was just like done to like i don't know like really prove a point like and i, and I enjoyed it man yeah I, I mean i i definitely can agree i want to say i feel like you know for us not having to or us not doing taming in so long i mean we kind of i feel like i we both kind of forgot how it is but I don't know. I feel like between him and Jimin, bro, I feel like they have this certain type of like edginess in their dance. It's like it's almost like a it's like, oh, I feel like you can teach choreography and it can look good. But at the same time, it's like you can also take it and add like an edge to it. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I can see it within both of them. And it's weird to kind of do them back to back because I feel like that wasn't planned. But at the same time, next thing you know, they got us wanting to react to some dance challenge that has both of them in Taman song. But at the same time, for them to collab and me to feel like their dancing styles was kind of similar. Like they both have this like edge that kind of draws you in. But I, I like the song, man. I feel like um, I, I love this wordplay within the song. I love mm-hmm. a lot of stuff he was saying as far as like how she was kind of making him be... Um, something he wasn't but at the same time it was like he was okay with it because it almost was like it just i feel like it soothed him in a way to kind of be how this person was making him be Mm -hmm. like he said something about fingerprints on the heart on his heart and just feel like i don't know i feel like when you could kind of visually put in your head how something is being said lyrically i feel like but how it's said i feel like it helps so much more and a lot of stuff he was saying was just kind of making me it helped to really understand of how much this girl had a hold on his just whole demeanor like even for him like you said to be locked up the whole time it's Mm -hmm. like she kind of was just like she got that much control over him Mm -hmm. but i thought it was dope man i I really loved it for dance and the choreography the edginess of the choreography and i liked it for the wordplay in the song i wish i could have seen the girl though i wish they could have just made it like I don't know why I want. I feel like I needed that, but mm-hmm. the, everything was dope. But I feel like I still wanted to see her. But and also too, guys, as far as like the red and the black in the beginning, like, I kind of want to know: does that like signify anything as far as like the him standing out from them, or like was that just done for like choreography purposes? And also too, man, I want to say this too, really quick. As far as taming, bro, like there is always something where I see in these artists and and I'm looking at taming in general. But they have their own like unique style that adds like a smoothness too and i guess that's more so what caden was saying too as far as like an edgy type of thing but i can always sense to where it's like it's, it's sometimes when somebody will tell you to do a dance move and you do it how they told you to do it but then you also add your own flavor yeah, that, but that's what i felt like i was seeing it was like he was doing certain things that was just like of course like the rest of the group is meant to look i don't want to say they're meant to look but they do but at the same time it's like you already know the moves you know what it's like i feel like it's like chris brown in a sense Mm -hmm. it's like he can find a dance and it's like everybody else can do the same dance and they might have their own spin on it too but it's like when it's like a chris brown version of what that dance was it's like it's always gonna have something else in it something slight to make it Mm -hmm. his own Mm -hmm. i feel like what that's what they do exactly exactly and it's not this and that's not to come off you know talking about other artists i know people try to stay tell us to stay on topic we're just trying to make trying to give you all the uh like a correlation to yeah, see. the correlations that bring it back into one but just seeing like how just his his unique style seems like it's added into his moves to exaggerate stuff and i feel like that's what makes people stand out as themselves and say you know you can go into something and say oh you know 
people are like, oh, K-pop is saturated. Not saying anybody has ever said that, but you know, I'm pretty sure people, some people may say it or something like that. But at the same time, when you add your own unique spin on certain things, that's what makes people stand out as far as being their own artist and saying like, I didn't know I needed this until I watched it, but now I know I needed this. Mm-hmm. So it's like, with that being said, guys, I enjoyed this. We definitely gonna check out some more. For sure. Definitely, definitely gonna get us some more. Thank you for the reaction request. But we're gonna go ahead and get on out of here, guys. Once again, my name is Kogan. It's your boy Kaden. And that's Skull Pack React. <laughs> 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 Gate was so close. <laughs> it's not gonna <laughs>